it's a very traumatic experience to get your chest ripped open. You know, that's, that's major. And we've advanced that physical and that technology so far, and yet a person can be left broken. It was like being impaled, and all of a sudden there's that feeling of uh, being fairly helpless, actually, and how am I going to get through this? You know, I haven't got any tools. I've never had to deal with this. The emotional recovery is huge, and it often goes un undetected, unrecognised, and not supported. No one ever has mentioned to me that there might be um, a need for me to go and see somebody about psychological problems, emotional problems, cognitive problems. I didn't know what the symptoms were to look out for, um, so that all came as really a big shock to me. And so it took me quite a while to say to them, you know what, I think I need help. Just like cutting my life in two, I think we are really alone on this road and I would even go further, sometimes lonely. We're getting the right outcomes medically for the patients but the psychological outcomes are just as important because that's the reason why we keep patients alive, is to live their life, not to just be alive. <laughs>